Hey, what's everybody? This is Garrett from Brody Act Studios. Give you the first episode of our BS news, our bullshit news. This is going to give you everything you need to know about the gaming world at the moment. Okay, now the biggest two things people are talking about is the Xbox One and the PS4. What's going to be in it? Uh, what kind of games are going to be included for it? Uh, how much is it going to be? When can I buy it? Those are huge questions, and I'm going to answer them for you right now. Uh, so here we go. Let's go ahead and start off. We're going to move straight to price. The Xbox is going to run you to about $500, while your PS4 is going to run to you about $400, okay? Now, both of these do have Blu-ray players. That's a big upgrade for the Xbox, considering it did not have one uh, last generation. Uh, move straight on to the CPU. CPU in the Xbox gives you a one-chip AMD core processor. It's got eight cores in it. It's going to give you a nice, uh, well-rounded processor to run all your stuff on. Um, now, the PS4 is going to give you an eight-core Microsoft custom CPU. Now, this is going to be a, a big upgrade uh, on both systems, which is good. We're, gonna, we're loving the new stuff. Now, the most important thing everyone's going to be talking about is this GPU. What kind of graphics performance it's going to have? And, of course, they're outrageous. We're going to give you the best of the best. Xbox is going with the AMD graphics core with 1,152 shaders. Now, that's a huge upgrade as to the old NVIDIA, NVIDIA cards Xbox One, or Xbox 360 has. Now, the PS4 is upgrading as well, also to an AMD Radeon. It's at 853 megahertz with 768 shaders. Now, that's actually a less performance than the Xbox One, which is, uh, to me, surprising, um, to be completely honest. But we'll see how it pans out. Uh, when the launch happens. So you're actually getting a better GPU with your Xbox One. Now, um, all of these have cloud storage and all have the USB 3.0. So this is actually a huge upgrade, uh, more universal use for USB in this system for sure. Now, the next thing we're going to talk about is our RAM. This is our most important part, in my opinion, because it, it's such a crucial difference between the two systems. Um, the Xbox One is going with DDR3 RAM, normal, everyday computer RAM that's been ran on everything. Uh, now, but the PS4 is going with the GDR. RAM. Now this RAM is extreme upgrade. It's a gaming RAM. So what GDR means gaming RAM. This is going to be a huge upgrade. You're going to definitely see the performance difference on the PS4. So uh, that's all I have to say for you guys. Uh, thank you for tuning in to Brody Hack Studios News or the BS News. Um, I'm Garrett. And, uh, it's What's up guys? It's Trevor from Brody Hack Studios. Hope you enjoyed that video. Hit that like button. Feel free to subscribe to us. And if you want to see similar videos, there will be one right here. Maybe one right here. Maybe another one right here. You never know. All right. Later, guys.